Hey, it's me, Zarnov, and welcome back to the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim Anniversary Edition Legendary Difficulty Survival Mode Playthrough. How are we doing, guys? I'm doing fantastic myself. If you guys are enjoying this playthrough as much as I am, please consider liking, please consider subscribing. It all really, really helps out now in this episode. We're getting on with... What is this? I think this is the Autumn? The Autumn? Yeah, the Autumn's Bells. That's what we're getting on with. We're, get, we're clearing through the seasons of this Dwemer ruin, and um, oh, wowza, 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 I am enjoying this aesthetic actually quite a lot. I wish I did this earlier now that I'm going through it, because this is very very nice and what have we got here the horse right front leg this is uh cool this is uh i'm actually i'm actually really really enjoying this to be honest note on autumn i'm actually really enjoying this this is uh this is a really cool idea for some quests and uh yeah i'm i'm really not minding going through this uh this little uh dungeon here um where is it autumn note on autumn there we go Mage says we gather the different types of wheat and place them in the depositories. Okay. Mage says we have to harvest wheat and stuff in and stuff it in the depositories. Uh, only I don't know which wheat goes in which container. Seems like the symbols on the signs and or, and the depositories might be a clue, but they all look the same and it's making my head hurt. Shaw's bones. This isn't what I signed up for. If I wanted to work on a farm, I'd go back to Rorikstead. The treasure better be worth it. Okay. Okay. All right. Let's get... Ooh. What's in here? What is that? What did I just see? What is this thing? I don't know what it is. Okay. Um, Alright. I'm guessing... Okay, I'm, I'm guessing the wheat isn't going to be necessarily hidden from us, so I don't think we've passed any. I think we can just kind of trudge along forward to give you guys an update. I still do have tonsillitis. It is calming down. It is a day after from uh, the... I think it's episode two, 213 that was just published... Uh, yesterday, or maybe it was today. I cannot remember. I know I'm uploading 214 right now, though. Uh, so this will be episode 215. So long as I'm not completely incorrect and completely out of sync with my uh, timetable while I'm trying to describe this and kill this guy. Um, let's quickly do this. But yeah, the tonsillitis is getting better. I'm still not at a point where I can allow myself to get super excited about anything that's happening in the game, or at least I have to try my best to mitigate it not get too loud. Eating still hurts. I have to be very particular with how I eat. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. I still have to be very particular with how I eat and whatnot. Just to give you guys an update for those of you that have tonsillitis before, you must know it is awful. Well, actually, I suppose it depends how bad you got the tonsillitis. I got it pretty dang bad. I got it real bad just on the one side of my throat, just on the right side of my throat, and I don't know how people get tonsillitis on both sides of their throat because if I got it on both sides, my throat would have like it literally would have been closed it literally would have closed oh i didn't want to pick that up it literally would have closed off because the right side swelling up was uh it was bad it was bad i'll leave it at that but it was bad it was a uh, good couple days of not actually sleeping correctly like i think over at, at its worst point at its peak worst point there was yeah, two almost completely sleepless nights. I think my watch tracked that I got like two hours total sleep or four hours. Two hours or four hours. I think it was like two hours each night or it might have been two hours in total over both of the nights that I saw like one hour and a bit and then another hour and a bit because I was literally just up all night uh, just gargling warm salt water and taking as much Panadol as I could but uh, the Panadol wasn't doing much. As I knew. What is going on there? Is that that's that's not how that's not how they're supposed to move. Why are his legs drooping around like that? Um, <laughs> that looks weird. Um, are you doing the same thing, good sir? Let's sneak up on him. Are you doing the same thing with droopy legs? No, you're not. Okay. And boop, gotcha. And boop, get you again. And boop, you see nothing, got you again. And you see something, don't you? Yes, you do. Alright. Just... Oh my... Goodness gracious me, have I not taken a hit from these guys before? How did that do so much damage? I thought I was, uh... I thought I could take a couple hits from these guys. I will not be... I will not be continuing to have that thought process. Because that is a thought process that's going to get me, uh... Quite dead. Quite dead indeed. Let's see if we can... Eat... 
eat up a few of these potions just to get ourselves a bit more carry weight. And, ooh, another quest marker here. What is this? Ooh, another part of the horse. Horse back left leg. Okay, nice. Mercenary. Gold, thank you. Chest. Gold. Thank you, thank you. Yes. And no. And hello there. Get a few more hits off into you. Didn't, didn't quite charge that one up all the way. That's okay, though. Jump up here. Hello there. How you doing? Are you able to make it up here? It's a little bit of a steep thing. Can you guys jump? Is there a jump animation for you guys? Or are you kind of just stuck there and you can't do much about it? Ooh, lightning arrow. Boom. Bit of extra damage for you. And boom. Bit of extra damage for you. And we don't need to waste another lightning arrow on this fella. He'll go down with just about any arrow I pick. There we go. See you later. Alright, let's... Is this guy still doing it? He is. Look at his legs. Look at his legs. I wish I could zoom in from here. Look at those legs. <laughs> there's something There's something going on with that guy. Okay. Um, do I have a royal? No, 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 no. Grand Soul Gem. Ruby. Wheat. Is is that what I need? I need to stuff the wheatses. I need to stuff the wheatses in the depositories or whatever it is. Um, Alright, let's go over here. What is this? Is this a depository? I had a... Okay, that's wild spiky grass. Glowing red wheat. Oh. Hey there. How you doing? No, no. Stop giving me all these prestige arrows. Give me... Give me... Give me... Orcish arrow. I got tons of them. Steel arrow first. Steel arrow, then orcish arrow. There we go. And see you later. Alright, what have you got for me? Common soul gem. Jeez, I really wish I did this journal. Uh, just journal. This, uh... Just, let's just get all the... Can I just keep... Can I just keep getting a ton of this stuff? Okay. I think I got enough now for sure, right? Food, glowing red, red wheat. Or is that going to be in misc? Yeah, glowing. Okay, I got 37. Okay, I think I'm okay in the wheat department. But I don't know... Nope, don't shoot that. I don't know what it is I'm supposed to do with it yet. Well, i got to stuff it in depositories, but... I don't know what those depositories are. Or where they are. Is it something here? No, that looks like a solid wall. Alright, let's wrap around this way. Hello. Okay, there's a Dwarven Centurion there. Let's see if we can't get a good angle on this fella. Hello there. My friend. Get you with that. Get you with that. Get you with that. Oh, you, 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 you stopped at a weird spot there, buddy. You don't even act like that was... All right. And there we go, you found me. All goods. And a couple more for you, big boy. Oh my potion, potion. Give me a bunch of them. You're gone. And a few more for you. One more set. And Busca. Done. Okay. Give me that and that. Why not? And where's the big boy? There he is. Give me that and that and that. And I'm sure I'll take some weed as well in case I need regular wheat. I'm not sure if I need glowing red wheat or... Okay, we got some blue luminous wheat. And we got a little rabbit. Hello there. Hey there, little rabbit. How are you doing? You're, you're a unique looking rabbit, so I got it. Okay, what have you got for me? Okay, I didn't mean that. Okay. You looked like a unique rabbit. You looked like you had some stuff on it. Okay. Let's take a bunch of this stuff. Blue luminous wheat. Let's get around about the same as the red wheat we got. Is there a thing here? Okay, so I'm not sure what I have to do with this. Okay. Um... Let's keep wrapping around this way. Make sure we see this whole room. Okay, so it looks like I've done the... Yeah, it looks like I've done those two sections, the red and the blue. Goats? Oh, hello there. 
Um, maybe that's where I gotta put it? Hey there. Okay, I'm not gonna kill you, buddy. Uh, Alright. So it's a big old room. My goodness. My goodness gracious me. This is definitely putting into like better perspective, I guess, what the... I didn't even notice that was up there. I'm guessing this is... Uh, well, not I'm guessing. I'm thinking this is put... I'm not thinking. This is pudding. <laughs> this is pudding. Um, like the Dwemer cities and the Dwemer potential and all that kind of stuff. I don't know. It, I think this is like framing it better than a lot of the uh, vanilla Dwemer... Vanilla Dwemer dungeons that Bethesda have done. Not to say they're bad or anything, but I think this is kind of putting it more into like a grandiose perspective of what the Dwemer are and what they could do and all that kind of thing. Um, I'm just going to swim over to this side. Let's get some air. Is there something down here? No? No? No, no sneaky things that this person's tried to sneak in under my nose? No chests or anything? Okay. Let's go up. Yeah, I think this just, I think this just does a better uh, a better job of like encapsulating Dwemer cities and whatnot. Okay, it's an empty chest. That was a waste of time. Yeah, I think it just does a better job of encapsulating things, uh, putting like the grandiose of the Dwemer into perspective. I guess if that's a grammatically correct sentence, I'm not sure it is. And hello. Oh, okay. Wow, we're putting this horse together pretty quickly. Nice. Um, recover, okay. Jeez, I hope, um, I hope there weren't any legs in that summer thing that I just completely missed. And look at you, why are your legs all funky there, buddy? Are they gonna, I think, I think I saw them starting to fix up. I think the physics or whatever started to fix up as I approached. So we're not gonna have the funny, the funny limp legs going on. And let's pick up a bunch of orange encrusted weeds. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get you in just a sec. Just gonna pick up a bunch of this stuff. Just make sure I've got enough. All right. Hello there. And let's kill you. Don't do that, please. It's not nice. All right. So you can still hit me. So you're gonna stay here. Good stuff. You just stay right there in front of me. Thank you. Thank you. And a couple more for you. Oh, one more. That'll do. And where are you at, my little spidey friend? Boom. And boom. And one more. Boom. Nice. Alright, I'm not going to bother searching them. Let's keep pushing through. Um... Yeah, your leg's fixed up. Oh, that's so disappointing. Okay, where, where, where's, uh, where's, where's, where's my spot? There you are. Found ya. Found ya, buddy. You thought you could hide from me in the tall grass. It's a pretty cool thing, though. Whoop. Pretty cool thing having this tall stuff everywhere. Just, I don't know. It's different. It's different, because now you've got these things that can kind of semi-hide in them. Like, things can kind of semi-hide in them. I don't know, you're not hiding from them, because they can see you clear as day, just with their AI and whatnot. But for me, you know, I, I think it's a good thing. It's great. I'm definitely loving this dungeon. I don't know how many times I'm going to say it, but uh, I don't think I can really emphasize it enough just how much I'm loving this aesthetic and what they've done with this. Just give me a bunch of this, and yep, I know you're there, buddy. Just give me a second. Give me one second. Sickly green. Ooh, sickly green. Yuck. Okay, let's heal ourselves. Might as well try and get some restoration up. And where are you? Hello there. Ooh, you're a master. Okay, I'm okay. Let's let's stop using this just for a bit. Let's let's quickly blast our way through this. Yep, 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 and yep, and yep, and yep. One more for you. There we go. Okay, nothing from you. Won't bother searching the spider. Okay, so we got the sickly green wheat. Um. I've got all the wheatses now. What do I do? I'm assuming I've got to go through here. That seems like the only the only outlet for this whole place. Hey there, your legs are all fixed up. Good to see, you, buddy. Um, all right, we'll kill you quickly. Harvest Dwarven Centurion. Okay, I'm gonna guess you got something special. I don't remember the other Dwarven Centurion. I have. Oh my! Please no. <laughs> Please no. Please don't tell me I gotta start this whole thing again. 
I'll bring you guys right back. Okay, I am back and I've cleared out all the enemies. I did not bother going through using my bow and arrow again. I just was smashing them with the spells because I wanted to get it over and done with very quickly. And I also wanted to mention... Oh, hello there. I thought I cleared out all the enemies. Guess not. We got you. We're going to pop up once I collected this wheat. Um, I also picked up on something I missed the first time through. So, you know... You know, it's uh, slightly good, I guess, that I died. Is that in the sensor, I thought it was just going to be in each corner. So you got the red stuff or the orange stuff, whatever it is. The blue stuff over there. The uh, other colored stuff over there. But also in the center, there was white moldy wheat. And in the center here, there is off color wheat. So there was six in total. I thought there was only going to be four. Uh, so luckily, we went through again. Because otherwise, I could have been a, a quite a confused little zan of there for a little bit. But yeah, everything's cleared out now. Oh, look at all these little rabbits. Oh, I mean, okay, I'm not going to do that. That's just me. Okay, let's save here because I do not want that to happen again. That was awful. That was terrible. I do not want to experience it again going through the... Ooh. Pro. Okay, let's... <laughs> Come on, soul gem. Okay, do I really... Do I, do, no, I don't need them. I shouldn't pick them up. They're soul gems. I want to pick them up, but I'm not going to. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. Don't stress. Um, activate lever. All right, so we got you opening up for us. Dwarven Sphere Guardian. I need you to just kindly step aside for a quick little tittle bittle there. Thank you. And what have you got? You got anything good for me? Nothing. Uh, Great soul gem, but otherwise useless. Useless. Useless little dwarven sphere. Um, nothing up there. Okay. Is this where I put all the wheatses? Dwarven autumn visage. Was there a summer thing that I missed? No, I did find the Mask of Summer, actually. No, 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 I did. I did, I remember. I remember, didn't I? I did, didn't I? Did I, did I, did I? Jeez, I can't remember now. Okay, maybe I didn't. Is there... There mustn't be a Mask of Summer. Okay. Summer, you're left out. You don't, you don't, you don't get anything. You don't get anything special. Where do I put the wheat? Where do I put the wheat? Because right now, I am... I am oh so confused. Gather the different types of wheat and place them in the depositories. To reach the conduit of autumn, I need to open a massive door. The door seems connected somehow to the pipes and depositories nearby. Is it disable? Okay, so I need to disable the conduit of autumn, but what? It's, it's, what? How? How do I do this? Some Something tell me, please. That closes that. That's all it does. Is there anything off to the side? Doesn't look like it. I said there's a massive door. Okay. Guess I, I better be on the lookout for something that looks like a massive door. Because <laughs> I don't think I've seen that yet. Um, Alright. Where is this massive door we speak of? Is it in this room or is it a completely different room? It must be, Yeah, it must be in a different room. But I've got to disable something in here, right? The question is what? I've got to disable... Is it something over here? Is it this thing? This looks like it could be a thing. No. Unless these are doors. I mean, they look like they could be doors. They look, they definitely look like they could be... Oh. What are you doing, bud? What are you doing? What was that? What are you trying to do there? Um... Hmm... Yeah, I'm really hoping this, this, this doesn't uh, turn into an episode of me just running around saying, Hmm... <laughs> Because I feel like that might be what this is about to turn into if I can't figure this out. Quick six. I'm assuming it's got something to do with this, but I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this. Do I... I got no idea what I'm supposed to do with it, with those things. Um... Or maybe the conduit is something down here and opens up that door? Color me... Very confused. Is the autumn mask like something I can put on and it does something? What are the depositories? Just give me just give me just give me a clue there. Just give me a clue there, quest quest giver, please. Just need just need anything. I'll take anything. I will take any bit of help I can get. Before I should have quick saved. Before I jump down. And then I'll be able to quick load all the way back up. But that's that's not the way Zarnob's brain works right there. That is not the way it works. Um, 
Okay. All right. All right. Hmm. Has it got something to do with this bridge, maybe? It is just so hard to see because of all this stuff everywhere. I mean, it's probably it's probably that's that's probably a design choice on purpose, but it is uh, definitely does make it hard to see. Uh, maybe these pipes lead somewhere. I'm literally looking for anything, anything that looks like it could be a something. I mean, we got this over here as well, which looks the same as that door over there. But I just don't know if it actually means anything. I just don't know if it actually means anything at all. Maybe I'm not getting a quest update because I missed one of the Wheatses or something? Or is this it here? It is this, right? It's got to be this. Oh, and I wasn't taking note of which wheat was what. Oh. <laughs> okay, well, I figured it out. Um, Alright, so there's that there. That looks like another part of the horse. Okay. Alright, well, let's quickly, let's quickly do this then. So the red wheat goes under the T. So red wheat, T, T, T. Oh, okay, good. Oh, oh goodness. Oh, okay. I thought I had. To, oh, that's that's amazing. I thought I had to go into my inventory and then put in the correct weeds. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, I love it. Okay, thank you very much, Quest Giver. That that is a that is a convenience that I didn't even know I needed or I was going to get, but I so so appreciate. <laughs> Horse head. There we go. Uh, pile of gold. How much is that going to give me? Level up available. Wait until all those things go. Gold one hundred. Ah. Chop change. Disable the, or, the conduit of autumn, gather the different types of wheat and place them in the depositories. Okay. So we're rocking and rolling. We're doing good. All the wheats is gone. I could have just taken one, I suppose, and didn't need to take them all, but that's fine. That's all good. I'm happy with. So that's done. So now we move on to the next. The next, uh, the next one. What's the next one? So we've got, I think it's winter. I think the next one is winter, but I kind of wanna, I kind of wanna have a look at the fella that's guarding the big door up the back, which I'm guessing is what opens once we, uh, once we figure out all this. Gee, there was a lot of, there was a lot of, there was a lot of horse items in in that one actually. How many horse items did we get? And there would be, yeah, there would be. Okay, so we got the, the left back leg, the left front leg, the right front leg, and the head. So so, yeah, horse head, left back leg, left front leg, right front leg. Was there a right back leg in there that I am missing? Golly, oh gosh, I hope not. Golly, oh gosh, I hope not. Let's keep trudging forward. You know what would be the worst thing is if I actually picked it up the first time round and then the second time round while I was off camera I didn't pick it up because I forgot about it. I don't think that's the case, though. I hope that's not the case, though. I really, really hope that's not the case. <laughs> and hello there. Oh, yes, I want to have a good look at you. I'm guessing if I fall down there, it's an insta-death. But you are a big old... You're a, oh, oh, okay. Oh, okay, so if I approach, yeah, I've got to do all this stuff first, I guess. And he disappears. Dang, I really wanted to... I kind of wanted to kill him right now. I was... Uh, my patience... My patience was at zero, and I wanted to kill him right now. <laughs> All right. Uh, oh, geez, do I want to? Do I want to go in there? If the right leg could be. Hmm. 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 I don't know. Let's have a look around this room anyway for a bit. See what there is to see. Make sure I'm not missing anything. I don't think I would be. It's just the doors. Camps there, yeah. Let's let's quickly do one quick lap. Let's just do one quick lap of this place, and I'm just going to make doubly sure I didn't miss a sing. I didn't miss a thing because I find it weird that um, all the parts of the horse. Or actually, did I already pick up the front right leg at some? And already no, no, I didn't go back outside and put it back on the horse. I definitely didn't do that. Okay. Let's uh, let's make sure. Yep, so we're in here. No leg there. No, no, no. Okay, so that's all empty. That's all good. That's all. Oh, I missed this chest. Are you kidding me? 
Are you are you kidding me? Somebody somebody slapped me across the face. I can't believe I missed that chest. That's that's I mean it's so far it's so in your face. How could you? Okay, let's quickly run around. I'm not gonna look anywhere specifically. I'm just gonna run around because I didn't run around and do all the usual things I did when I was speed running it the second time after I died. So I didn't go up and down these stairs. Um, I just grabbed that leg there, whatever leg that was, and that leg there, and there was a horse head in there. Um, but I don't think there's anything else here. So I'm just going to quickly run through the center here, see if a quest marker pops up, tells me to grab something. If it doesn't, I think we're all squeezy, and yeah, I don't, nothing's coming to memory of something I picked up the first time round and didn't pick up the second time round. Nothing's coming to memory, but we're also talking about my memory, so there's a good chance that it wouldn't happen anyway. And these aren't doors that lead anywhere, right? They didn't open up, no. Okay, I think we're okay, because you go through that door and you get the horse's head. Okay, I think we're fine. Let's let's run back out. Sorry to waste everybody's time. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm, my head's just jumbled. I'm just thinking of things on the fly. I, 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 I don't know what to say. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about it. Uh, well, this was actually pretty fun, and I can't actually... Oh. My goodness, I'm thinking, this is autumn. The summer one was pretty cool too, that little gimmick thing, you know, having the spider rod, and it's great actually. I mean, uh, I was I was f fearing the worst that they were all gonna have the same similar kind of puzzle thing, like, oh, okay, so I use the rod to control the spider, it opens up things, and then I was thinking, oh geez, it's, I mean, it's fun the one time round, but, Pardon me. It's fun the one time round, but if uh, if all the other seasons had like the exact same thing, wouldn't have been good. But this this whole twist, this wheat depository thing, you know, it uh, had me scratching the old Zarn of Noggin for a second. Not too long, but it had me scratching it for a second. And uh, yeah, it's it's really appreciated. I really, really, really love quests like this. Okay, let's uh, let's run in there and uh, get over to the winter side and let's have a little peek see inside and at least see what the uh, the front area has in store for us little little snickety little snickety pickety little sneaky peeky winter's chimes oh sounds like a great area too all right a little sneaky peeky but that is gonna have to do it for today's episode guys if you guys are enjoying this playthrough as much as i am please consider liking please consider subscribing every like means a good new like and every subscriber means a new subscriber and it all really really helps out please also turn the notification bell and leave any comments below any recommendations any tips or just up by to say good day because i absolutely love the interaction i promise i'll try my best to respond to everyone but most of all please have a fantastic day bye bye